Well, it's time for another update on the landscaping project. So, um, yeah, we got quite a bit done. Now, let me show you around and kind of also tell you what I'm thinking about doing because I don't seem to ever be able to stop at one thing. Um, I, You know, I complain a lot about being sore and tired and I get all cranky. And then I get like a day away from it and I want to start doing something again. So just ignore when I'm being a little baby so let me show you what we've done this is this goes out to the side yard and uh, you can see the grapes of all look at the vines coming out there already uh, a little peach tree i dug a little water well for it today did some weed eating along the fence man the weeds in this place are crazy uh transplanted the the lemon and it's blossoming here i thought we lost it but no oh, man these blossoms smell good too Lemon and orange blossoms smell great. Uh, we're still working on the deck, still sanding that down. But you can see we're getting some flowers in there, and furniture is getting arranged. And uh, first, there's Gracie's rear end for you. And uh, still have to sand this, but yeah, it's starting to look good. Flowers are out. There's a little peach tree. You know, the chairs and the swing over there. We laid that tile a few years ago. Um, I always like the Mexican tile. Uh, actually, I like it just about everything. Here's a little new rug got set up on the on the deck. Here's what it looks like going that way. Yeah, I got, oh, got some corn growing there and some squash that needs to get replanted because the chickens are doing what chickens do. Dogwood flowers, are, they're all gone now. It's getting, starting to get warm, but the petunias are coming out. And uh, this curly willow, and that's a Japanese maple, and dahlias, and looking on that. And here's the new deck. Still have to put the handrails in, create a gate. I don't like finishing work. Oh, there's the chicken, owns the place. That's a very, very friendly chicken, by the way. Um, see the rhododendrons have come out. And see the flowers down here. And the chairs were put up and this new deck. Uh, Japanese maple, dogwood trees, pink. Um, there's that pressure washer getting ready to wash that. And yeah, I need to mow the lawn, but I didn't do it. These Japanese maples, I want to um, keep small, and let them, so I'll probably prune this out, prune that off a little bit. But you can see things are. There's another grape. And last year we made um, grape jam from that that grapevine right there. It's Concord grapes, and that, man, grape jam is so good. Um, I know a lot of people don't like it, but I I think they got something wrong with them. There's the chicken, one of the chickens. Look at that rotor dinner. Look how pretty that thing is. Just blossomed. Uh, there's some more chickens doing their thing. Tomato plants are growing. Right in here, these are all the gourds that we planted and they're gonna grow up over that uh, trellis that we made. We had to put new squash in because Gracie wanted to bury her ball in there and she did and she destroyed it. And then the chickens finished it up. Bugs are eating our our flowers, so we got uh, some organic uh, wash today, and we're gonna spray all that. And then there's some more tomatoes. And they're doing pretty good. It's kind of shady back here, but they're doing good. So now what I'm thinking about um, is getting into this mess um, and making another area back here. You can see that's where the neighbor's neighbor's house is, and that's my side yard over there. That's where the chickens live, are supposed to live. So I started digging that out. I want to put some, uh, maybe some railroad ties or something for steps. And I want to put sod in here, and then maybe a couple fruit trees. And over here, some Japanese maples and, and dogwood. This was an idea that never got finished, but we started building a wa waterfall in here some time ago. Um, I'm gonna, we, we collected all these rocks. Man, that was when we were younger. Those suckers were heavy. And we um, 
we're going to we're going to put a pond in here but when we had grandkids i just got afraid of having that kind of water i know i got a pool right there right but i had a fence around it anyway inconsistency um but now i gotta decide what to do one day i would like to build a chapel just a little chapel out in here just a little small little thing um i don't know why just a sacred space i guess but i'll probably screw that up too like i screwed the other sacred space up and then here is the side yard and this is a kennel that gracie never uses but i'm thinking about moving the chicken coop over to this area and that's a shed i built and then the kids all came over and helped me finish it um and it's it's a total mess but i'll show you something's kind of cool all the all the grandkids names are in there they all put their their names on there and right there it says happy 60th grandpa and um that was almost five years ago that's where we keep the chicken feed and then over here is this chicken coop the hen house but we let them run loose I only put them in at night and here's some fruit trees that's a pluot oh, pluots are like a plum and an apricot and this is an apricot and this is a nectarine and a plum we got a really late uh, spring hailstorms so these didn't really set any fruit then over in these little bins is just some hobby uh, peppers growing the peppers in there and then right in this bin this is where the chickens were when they're little chicks I kept them in here didn't want to throw it away and now I just put in some cutting flowers I'll see how they grow sunflowers and stuff like that and that's the side yard anyway so I'm gonna have to put see that water spout I'm gonna have to run a, a line out to my new project because I don't have any water out there so I'm gonna have to trench it from here and trench it all the way through that gate so it'd be a lot easier to water things when we get things planted out there. And that's it, that's a long video, huh? Talk to you later. Well, yeah, one more thing, I, um, I reached into my pocket and I grabbed a bunch of beans. <laughs> Sounds like a fairy tale, huh? And some coin. Man, there's a story right there. There's a children's story, hey, there's a song right there. Beans and coins. All right, talk to you later.